YouTube. It's your boy, Big Dog Man D Money, back again with your weekly update. We got a lot to get into. We got the Joey P6. Nobody saw this one coming. But let's not waste any time. Let's get into this update. All right, so let's see what we got on old Joey. What they gave Joey. I must say, man, it's been a long time coming, bro. It's been a long time. Let's see what we got. So for Joey, they gave him. Why did you want to give everybody that? Joey don't need manual block. For what? What did you put manual block on Joey for? I think Joey has like a 150 jump shot block. Something like that. I don't know. I guess. What else we got? We got pump fake spin. Why would they give him this? And backward spin. I can tell you right now. Well, none of these are bad. All these are actually really good. But I know some of y'all are going to try to be cute and try to do a hop step into this pump fake spin shot. And I'm telling you, I'm going to sit on it. I'm telling you, pause. I'm telling you right off the bat. I'm clamping that shit up. Don't try it. Do not try it. If you do a hop step into a spin shot, I'm telling you, I'm going to put you on your ass. But in all seriousness, not. Nah, all these are actually pretty good. But honestly, if it were me, I would probably go for a pump fake spin shot. I'm not even going to lie to you. I'd probably go with that one more than anything else. I know we got to look at the Com Joey bill, even though I like have like virtually no minutes on Joey, and I still wish I won't, I can get my intensive manuals back for him, cause he ain't got no P buffs that's worth having a P five for. Him. But this is what I run. Not bad, not bad. I don't even know what is this. I'm sure, this is a dunk success rate. Why would I? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. All right, so let's get into these events. First event we got off the books is the new Molly Shop opens up today. So the way that the Molly shop works, you purchase a certain amount of shopping bags, which in return will give you a certain amount of XP. The XP will go towards that blue meter. Once you fill up that blue meter, you will receive one mileage ticket. As you collect more mileage tickets, you then use those mileage tickets to purchase certain items out of the shop. So let's take a look at that. Click on that, go down the shopping bags and it brings you right to the mileage shop. So these are the old little things you can get out of the Molly shop, which these ain't too bad. Bunch of recycled stuff. Three intensive manuals and total 20 mileage tickets. You get P5 Joey. I ain't gonna lie, I kinda like the American Eagle outfits here. Kinda liking these, these ain't too bad. I mean, I just, can we get a dread, one with dreadlocks? Can I get just some type of representation in this game? Just a little bit. I ain't asking for too much. Just can you make this one with some dreadlocks? That'd be nice. I mean, my hair is way longer than that, but still, just can I get a little bit of representation? That's all I'm asking. Just a little bit. All right, next event that we have is the Comic Collect Masters event. So if you purchase the complete white spacesuit and the complete alien rabbit spacesuit, you will get that three on three freestyle banner. That reward will go out on the 29th. So it's not anything that you get immediately. You will get that in the 29th update. Next, we have the Rabbit Alien Collect event. So if you do purchase the complete Space Rabbit outfit, you will get that emote. That emote will go out also on the 29th update. And along with that, we got the White Space Suit Collection event. So if you could purchase the complete Space Suit, you will get that emote also on the 29th. So if you are planning on going for these outfits, I will say this. Now this space suit, I don't have nothing against. Usually if I see the white space suit, these people are typically not sailors. All right, especially in the rabbit outfit as well. But if you wearing that orange space suit, we got problems. We, we got problems. Next, we got the Astro rank has returned, which I mean, we should have got that in the last rank and then this one should have been, but it, it is what it is. Joy City, they do what they want to do. So if you are looking to get you a pet for a character, this is the rank you definitely want to try to participate in. Take your chances at getting the gold or the silver UFO. Ideally, you want to try to go for the gold UFO. You need to get double S to get the gold UFO. The silver UFO is not bad, but just the gold one is a lot better. So you want to definitely try to get that one. So for the Astro buffs, for this particular rank, there will be a buff to Quick Jumper, Fade Away, Drip Shot, pull-up jumper and double clutch so that's basically all the small forward skills all right for the typical rewards anything under a rank will get intensive notes and coins s rank and up will get 
gold tickets or a platinum ticket with P points. And here are your alternative rewards. All right, and just in case you don't know what's on the UFOs, I will show you because I just so happen to have both of them. All right, so for the gold UFO, three point success, normal movement speed, still success, still speed, and still to activate them, team rebound or ball recovery. There's also another one. So there's like, there are a couple of versions of the gold one. So the other one, team block or ball recovery. but the stats on them are the same. And for the silver one, same stats, three point success, normal movement speed, still success, still speed, still. To activate this one is a little different, still success, enemy team block success. So this one's a little bit harder to activate because it requires you to get a steal. So if you're not good at steals, you will probably not activate this one or you have to let someone block your shot for this one to activate. And of course, as you know, with every new P6 character, we get the stat boost event. All right, so this is nothing too complicated. So the way to approach the stat boost event, if you do plan on P6 and Joey, go ahead and do that first, play 25 matches with him, and you will collect every reward from this event. If you do not plan on P6 and Joey, but you do have a P6 character, play 25 matches with that P6 character, and you will at least get to 121 points. All right, next we got the Autumn Battle Pass Part 2. Which is damn near how? Joy City and these seasons, bro. I swear. All right, so let's take a look at the new emote. Zoomies. I ain't gonna lie, I'm rocking with it. I like it. And, bro, y'all play too much. What the hell is this? You know what? I, I'm not even mad at it. I'm a rocket. I'm not even mad at it. All right, and this is the part where Joy City tries to sell you stuff. So, first sale we got is the Cosmic Collection sale bag. This one will coincide with the mileage meter. So that is this bag right here. So if you're wondering how many bags you have to buy to get a ticket for the mileage shop, I will show you. So for this particular bag, keep going, keep going, keep going. Come on, control the hell. You need at least 13 of these bags to get one mileage ticket. And we'll just go ahead and cover the other two because they're in here as well. There's two other bags. So you got the intensive special bag. This one, you need 10 to get one mileage ticket. And where's the Joey one? And damn. All right, and for the Joey, you need 11. Don't scratch that, you need 12. 12 shopping bags to get one mileage ticket. Next, we got the intensive item promotion. So with every new P6 character, we always get this along with the stat boost event, so you already know how this works. Along with that, we got the Joey shopping bag renewal. The Joey bag is on sale for 9P. You get a chance at a P5 Joey. The ninja outfit with the ninja backpack. Not gonna lie, I'm seriously considering doing it just because I can get just because I want that that basketball I just want the basketball and if you're wondering that is a hundred and fifty percent XP ball next sale we got is the Joey management package so you know we got the Joey management package which that one is not too bad and then you got the Joey ultimate management package but don't ever buy the ultimate management package you can buy all those things individually and come out cheaper with a lot more if you just buy each one of those things individually so don't waste your pee on the ultimate management package, but the regular management package, that one's fine. They also brought back the platinum kennels. So there are two kennel packages in the shop. So if you're trying to get your platinum pet, you got a better chance at getting a platinum pet if you purchase one of those kennels. All right, that'll do it, folks. Overall, not a bad update. Me personally, never been really big on Joey. But I must say the P6 is a nice look for him. I'm telling you, I'm, I'm, I, I can see it right now. Y'all gonna piss me off with that hop step into the spin shot. I can see it already. Y'all gonna, I'm, I'm telling you, I'm clamping that. If you do it, I'm on your, I'm telling you, I'm on your head. I'm telling you, don't try it. Do not try it. Other than that, we still got, we still got the badge event still going on and we still getting double rewards for completing your dailies. Rank starts today. I'm not even gonna lie to y'all, man. I am 
this past week is, has burnt me out. Like it has been a struggle to get these games in. I, I can I can promise you. Like usually I start rank on day. I am not starting rank today. I am not. Like part of me wants to, but I am just so burnt out. I'm gonna get these eight games in, and I'm gonna hop up off of here. But that'll do it. Tell me what you think in the comments. Like, comment, subscribe, and all that other madness. And like that, we go.